Hello everyone, welcome to Spiritual Butterfly. Today I will be doing a love reading for Virgo singles. These messages are general, they will not resonate with everyone. Take what does, apply it, leave the rest. Also remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and click the notification bell in order to receive notifications when I post. So Virgo, I'm in like a very relaxed energy. So Spirit is saying like, you're finally going to be able to relax. Um, You're finally going to be able to be at peace when it comes to your relationships, your connections. Spirit is saying that you're getting everything that you want. Like finally your ships are coming in. Um, I have pulled some overall messages. And first we have the Empress, Knight of Cups, Knight of Pentacles, and the King of Pentacles. So Virgo, I feel like... You are in the energy of the Empress. Um, very nurturing, caring, I heard kind, um, I heard manifesting. You're in the energy of manifesting in this season, really calling in the things that you want. Virgo, you are pregnant with something. And what you are pregnant with, what you are getting ready to give birth to is a new life, a new beginning, especially when it comes to relationships and connections. I feel like these three cards is showing you what you are getting ready to bring into your life. You are calling in someone who is very loving, very family oriented. Um, if you have children, this is going to be someone who embraces your child or your children as their own. Um, the Kendrick Lamar song um, is coming to me. I can't think of the name of it right now, but it's a verse where um, he says, I really want to show you off. So yes, this person is going to want to show you off, Virgo. Yes, this person is going to want to let you be seen. This person is going to profess, you know, their love, their affection for you. And they're not going to be afraid of letting the world know. Knight of Pentacles, you're calling in something that is very stable. This is going to be a stable relationship. The person that you're calling in is very hardworking. I heard business owner. So this person may own their own business. I heard CEO. They may be the CEO of a company. But yes, this person is about their money. They're about their abundance. They're about their financial stability. And it's like they're going to see you. They're going to view you as the empress. They're going to view you as someone who they can build a family with, build a home with. So let's pull some more messages. Spirit, give me some messages for the Empress. I have movement. Things are getting ready to take off, Virgo. Yes, you are in a season of manifestation. Everything that you've ever wanted is getting ready to come in. Movement. Things are going to pick up very quickly for you. This person, this new love is on the horizon. Let's get a message for the Knight of Cups. I have a longing in the reverse and I have fear. Virgo, you no longer have to wait. You're no longer going to be waiting for this new beginning. You're no longer going to be waiting for a connection that is emotionally fulfilling. Um, with this fear, some of you may be hesitant because of your past experiences. It may take you a while to open up to this person, but eventually you will be able to let your guard down. Let's get a message for the Knight of Pentacles. Okay. I have new perspective. 
I feel like for some of you, you're definitely gaining a new perspective when it comes to relationships. Um, you're going to be seeking after someone who's more stable, who is able to give you um, what you want. I'm also getting that this person coming in is going to be very different from the people or the person that you have dated in the past. This is going to be a different type of relationship, something that you've never experienced before. Let's get a message for the King of Pentacles. I have fresh start. Yes, a new beginning, a new chapter in your life is getting ready to manifest, Virgo. Yes, your reading is about manifestation, finally calling in a divine connection, someone who is able to give you what you deserve. Yes, Virgo, this is beautiful, fresh start. I heard romantic. For some of you, this person is very romantic. I'm also getting looking for love. So yes, they're searching. They're looking for someone who they can settle down with, someone who they can build a life with. Um... For some of you, this person may have, may be divorced. Um, they may also have a child or children. This is definitely someone who is older. Virgo, this person will be much older than you, but they will be able to give you the new beginning that you want. And then at the bottom of the deck, I have jealousy in the reverse. So with jealousy, Virgo, I feel like you're not going to have to worry about um, this person is stepping out on you like this person is going to let it be known how they feel about you They're going to not only express it in their words, but they're going to show it in their actions and in their deeds You're not going to have to worry about any type of infidelity like this person um, Knows what they want and they're not willing to sacrifice a healthy relationship for something temporary I have loyal. This person is going to be very loyal, very dedicated to you. Um, I heard love you. So yes, this person is going to shower you with a lot of love, affection, and attention. Again, I heard I really want to show you off. Virgo, this person is going to be showing you off to family, to friends, to strangers. This person is not going to to try to hide this relationship like everyone is going to know how much they love you how much they care for you i heard like the love of their life so yes this person will see you as the love of their life and then i have action in the reverse yes again new perspective this is you getting a different view or having a, a different outlook when it comes to relationships because in the past you were connected to people who didn't give you what you wanted people who took no action you were in relationships that were not moving in a positive direction so this is you really reflecting on the choices of the past and choosing to do something different choosing to go after something that is going to give you what you actually want Virgo and then I have twin flame connection in the reverse so yes for some of you this person like i said they may have recently gotten a divorce or they may also have recently gotten out of a relationship so yes both of you are um kind of recovering from a connection um but this person is definitely looking to start fresh looking to try something new they're in an energy where they're open to love they're open to a new connection so let's pull some more messages I have the Seven of Wands in the reverse. And again, I heard older. So yeah, for some of you, this person is definitely a lot older than you. But Spirit says like they're still able to give you what you want. They're mature. So they will definitely be able to, to give you what you want. They're wiser. Um, they've learned too from their past choices. They've grown a lot. This person is evolved. I have the five of wands in the reverse. So let's get two more messages. I have the 10 of swords. Let's 
get one more. And I have the Seven of Pentacles. Okay. So, Virgo, I feel like this new connection, um, this is going to be a connection where you don't have to be guarded. Like, you can let down your guard with this person. Um, there's not going to be a lot of conflict or confusion in this relationship. This is going to be something that is going to bring a lot of peace in your life. Um, with this Ten of Swords, I just heard, like, healing. Um, I feel like both of you have went on your healing journey. And I heard, like, completion. You have completed your healing. Um, you have released things of the past. You have let go what no longer serves you. And it's like, now you are ready to invest. Now you are ready to give to a situation, to a romance. Um, with this Seven of Pentacles, I feel that this person may have some options. Um... I heard wealthy, so this person definitely is very financially stable. You know, they have, you know, men or women really seeking after them because of their status. But Virgo, it's like there's going to be something about you. Like you're this pinnacle on the ground, so there's going to be something about you that stands out. Um, I heard I Choose You, the song by Outkast. I Choose You. So yes, this person is going to make you their final choice despite the other options that are available to them. And then I have the world. So yes, I feel like with the world, there is a cycle coming to an end. Um, I feel like the cycle of you being single is getting ready to come to an end, Virgo. I feel like the cycle of you feeling like you have to be guarded and protect yourself is coming to an end because this person is going to make you feel comfortable um you're they're going to be very expressive it's like they're going to make you feel very sure of this relationship so it's like you're not going to start it feeling like you have to protect yourself you have to guard your emotions is over this is going to be someone that is going to help you feel very comfortable in this connection they're going to um make you feel loved and deserving um, this is something that for some of you, you've never experienced before where, you know, things just flow effortlessly. Um, you don't have to force anything. You're not the one putting in all of the energy, all of the effort. This is someone where they're going to give equally to the, to the relationship. And then I have the eight of pentacles in the reverse. This person does not have time to argue with you they don't have time for the conflict this is not someone who thrives off of chaos they don't thrive off of drama this is someone who wants peace in their life they're much older like they've been there they have done that this is not going to be a connection where you feel like you know you have to constantly um push and pull um that you have to constantly force this connection like no this connection is going to be something that is going to flow. You're not going to have to worry about any third party situations. There's not going to be any type of imbalance when it comes to, you know, conflict or having to deal with other people outside of the connection. This person is not someone who follows after others. And what I mean by that is that they don't thrive on the opinions of like family and friends this is someone who marches to the beat of their own drum they are their own person and they do not like drama at all it's like if you are a person full of drama this person is going to distance themselves from you this person likes peace um and they like stability in their life and then i have the king of wands so yes purity fire purity fire purifies this is healing this is you moving beyond the hurt you moving beyond the disappointment you moving beyond the pain in order to get to this new beginning you purging yourself of any type of toxic energy that does not benefit you you preparing yourself for this person you preparing yourself for this divine connection despite whatever challenges that you've been presented with in the past Virgo is like you are moving forward you are moving past the swords and you are getting to this new life the nine of cups in the reverse 
I feel like this person, if they have options, they're not happy with their options right now. They're not happy with um, the people that they're meeting. Um, they may be dating someone um, in particular, and they're not really satisfied with this person. Um, I heard like lack, like this person lacks something to them. Um, they don't feel like this person is a match, like this person just isn't the right fit for them. So I do see this person distancing themselves um, and just remaining single until they encounter you, Virgo. So yes, this person is getting ready to close out a cycle with someone. So let's pull some overall advice. I have the five of pentacles. I have the four of wands. I have the three of wands. I have the king of cups, Virgo. And I have the queen of cups, Virgo. Yes, this is a divine connection. Yes, this is a divine connection. Uh, the perfect match. You and this person are the perfect match. Um, you're both going to give to this relationship. You're both going to nurture each other. You're both going to nurture the connection. Um, for some of you, I see children. I see you having children with this person. With this five of pentacles, it's like whatever you go through in this relationship, whatever struggles, challenges, difficulties you face, you will face them together. This is not someone who's going to leave you stranded. This is not someone who's going to leave you to face challenges by yourself. This is someone who's going to hold your hand every step of the way, whether it's financial difficulties, illness, you know, sickness, whatever you go through, this person is going to be there by your side. I have the four of wands. So yes, this is going to be a connection that leads to ultimate fulfillment. This I heard like celebration. You're going to be so happy. This person is going to make you so happy. This relationship is going to lead to marriage. I feel like with this three of wands, you and this person are going to be able to build together. It's going to be able to grow together. Like this is going to be a very solid connection. Um... Spirit is saying the past. Don't let what you've been through in the past, Virgo, um, sabotage this relationship. For some of you, um, you may have like I heard a jealous streak. So you may have a tendency to become jealous, um, to question a lot because you've had people who have betrayed your trust. Um, and this person, like they're not in that energy, but you may project onto them because of the things that you've been through. Um, so it may take you some time to really let your guard down fully and to learn that, you know what, it's okay to trust in this situation. I feel like this person is going to help you gain more trust, build more trust, just because of how nurturing and caring they're going to be towards you. So yes, a spirit says like trust, you trusting, going back to the five of pentacles. In the past, you've been in relationships where if something happened, like if your car broke down or, or you didn't have enough, like you were by yourself, like that person wasn't there for you. You had to get it on your own. Yet they were supposed to be your spouse or they were supposed to be your significant other. But you were left out in the cold and you had to find a way. You had to make a way. You didn't have that support. But this person is coming in and they're going to say, you know, I am different. I am not like that. I will be with you. I will walk with you. So this is you making the transition mentally um, and understanding that, you know what, this person isn't the same. I may go into this five of pentacles energy, but I'm not going to be by myself. This person is going to be with me. This person is going to be my support system. I'm not going to have to walk this road alone like I have in the past. I can trust this situation. I can trust this relationship. I can trust this person. I can trust myself that I made the right decision this time. So Virgo, these are your messages. I hope they resonate. 
Remember to stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Everyone stay blessed.